PAQ presents Snap, Crackle and Depop. Wait, one second. <laughs> Free tea, mate. Got it. <laughs> Welcome, guys. We're PAQ. If you're coming, bro. <laughs> sorry, 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 yeah, no, sorry, sorry, do it, do it, do it. Welcome guys, we're PAQ. If you guys already know who we are, welcome back. If you are new, click subscribe, join the pack family. We are always looking for new cousins, aunties, uncles. I think Ellis is actually currently looking for a brand new brother-in-law. Especially on the market and all that, because yeah, you showed him that tooth oh boy. Yeah, you get it. <laughs> There's mummy otter, daddy otter and baby otter. Which one's the warmest? Baby otter, because he's a little otter. <laughs> lovely folk over at Depop have each given us a £500 voucher to spend, so we each have to find ourselves one summer outfit. So we each have 45 minutes and 500 quid to get our outfits, then heading over to Paris Fashion Week where it'll be judged by Scott. I think summer outfits are just an outfit that is practical for any occasion in summer. You could technically get a jacket as well because in Britain there is no summer. The only bright days I see is when Elias smiles. Aww. Well, what's your summer look, Daddy? Loafers, trousers, Fred Perry top. Yeah. <laughs> Depop is a sport. I don't know anyone that doesn't actually use Depop. Actually, my mum doesn't use Depop. I've bought a couple Astro shades of Depop. I bought a soul of Depop. 45 minutes, 500 pounds, Depop. I am going first for this challenge. The reason why these guys are sat right here is because there is a monitor in front of them lot and they can see exactly what I'm doing. Three, two, one, 45 minutes. So I went straight for filters. Right, I feel like I need to find something that's in good condition. I might even get the shoes like the main piece. Found my shoes and I was like, right, you know what? I'm gonna plan around that. Just go safe, man. Just get some Fred Perry Come on, Danny. Sometimes I want to see you spice up a little. Having them lot there to distract me was distracting. These are the worst shirts in the world. Look at that. That's not, that's hard. What, double collar? Yeah, that's sick. Get out of here. Yeah, that's like Ooh, some nice tennis hot Get pants. Get a mankini with some Fred Perry socks. So I've found a vest, no. a top, blue <laughs> shoes. No. Just type in Fashion Nova. <laughs> <laughs> or we'll type a pretty little thing. <laughs> I was thinking almost like, Leonardo DiCaprio kind of Romeo and Juliet. Did you type in Leonardo DiCaprio? <laughs> if I'm using this top as like my standout piece, then if I can match stuff to that kind of colour. Alright, cool, so you're going into your last 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying I'm struggling to find some socks. Yeah, get the pink half socks, Danny. I'm saying, innit? Get them. Oh my god. Oh, you cheeky little minx. You got two and a half minutes. You got two and a half minutes. You have two and a half minutes. Don't sweat. I think I'm ready. Three, two, one, go. I got off to a slow start. I was kind of just freestyling it. Um, let me see. Black. <laughs> Black. Mmm, <laughs> summery. <laughs> Summer. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm trying to get by. Right now, I'm looking at Jordan Oreo 4s. The Oreo 4s, I can never find them in my size. I felt like today was that day, man. Because I'm going to be in black, let me go a bit more summery. You know, get the shorts. Right now, I'm looking for T-shirts. Have you searched black T-shirt? Oh. Yes, I have. T yeah. I can see it, though. The Jordans and the black shorts and the thing. Last time we, when we done Selfridges, it was a very similar, you know, setup. I was like, nope, I'm not doing that again. You yeah. look like Jason Derulo or someone. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, <laughs> how's the <it> work? <laughs> Bucket hat. What's the boonie? Is it a boonie? Boonies with what, a string or crushes what, like. You basically a... want what I'm wearing, right? It's, I feel like this is very similar to yours. I mean, I'm pretty sure that's the exact same. <laughs> it's even got a brown tassel at the bottom. Wait, what's, how much time do I have? How, how, you have how, how much time four minutes and six. All right, get out. With pleasure. <laughs> Trust me. Right now, I'm finalising all my stuff. Who's going to oh, next out of me and you? Too. I'll go next. I kind of want to go next. No, too late. I said I'll go next. What paper, scissors is it? OK. OK, ready? <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors. 
I wanted to go. <laughs> best two out of three. No, no, no best two no, out of three. No, no, we done, we done. Best two out of three. No, we done, chat. You've always, you always love going last, so this is your, this is, this is. <laughs> no, I actually don't want to go last. Too late. I'm going next. No, you're not. I'm going no, next. No, you're not a fan. You just need rock, paper, scissors. I don't care. I'm going, nah. I'm going next. I'm going next. No, you're not. I'm going next. We'll see. When I rush back in there. Oh, I just want to make a quick disclaimer, right, before we start. There is a high chance that me and Elias will pick some of the brands. Shaq is covering his back now for when he starts copying Elias. I actually really need to just wee one sec quick. Nervous bladder. Psyching himself up. You got this, man. <sighs> Elias, man. Astro boy. Three, two, one. Oh. I was chill at the start, 45 minutes. I was like, this is calm. He's looking at the palace while his kingdom crumbles. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so good. <laughs> I haven't been a deep up in time, man. This is so reminiscent. The good days, mate. Oh, I should have got a rain jacket. Needles is sick. Yeah. I'm I'm like, I've been wanting these as well for time. Ooh. The palace rebox is the one. I should have checked out more polo stuff. If you refine it too much, you could be missing out on great stuff. So I kind of went with that tactic. How do you start your outfit? Do you start with the bro? I'm not gonna lie, I'm just mad in the zone. That, that is pink. That's that sick. Oh, that is a pink top. That is the best. What size was yeah. that? Don't worry. The first thing I settled on was the cream tiger print joggers. Come on, bro. I just, I let, literally was having a brain fart. Having lots of fun. Let me scroll down. Oh, is this the end of it? <laughs> For time, I've been wanting to see through Air Force One. So I was like, wow, I remember seeing a blue pair time ago. Oh, you found them? Size seven. Uh, I swear. Oh, do you know what? I'm this is 63 weeks ago. Alex. Yeah, that's like two years. Nah, that actually, is that nearly two years? My name just use my calculator. <laughs> As told from Elias from PAQ at Crep City, these are very rare. <laughs> what was that? Oh. That is so oh. Shout out to the Donny with the purple babes. This, this is a IG. shambles. Get an Ikea one. No. I know what shirt would actually be sick. Search Palace Umbra. No. Yeah, look at how sick that is. Actually, I'm not going to lie, this is actually quite cool. Maybe expensive though. How much is it? Whoa! Found a zebra bucket hat, but the zebra print was all kind of like that way rather than across. You have four minutes 45. Hold on, wait a minute. Y'all thought he was finished? How did you do the filter thing? Let's find that for yourself. Going into the challenge, I had a, I had a blank mind. I was like, whatever I find is whatever I find. I'm looking at related images. You got, none of you guys did that. Usually I actually would do that. That's how I find some stuff. Like some comics and stuff. I'm looking at elites right now. <laughs> I'm literally wearing this t-shirt right now. I already knew in my head, I said, okay, don't do something with dungarees again. It's not everyday dungarees, bro. Like, I know bro, it is do not, yeah, no, no, I mean, no, it is dungarees. No, but, no, but this is what I've learned some of. Time. Yo, these are hard. Let me, oi. These Carl Kanai dungarees are sick. I found those, those vintage Nikes and I wanted those for so long, bro. Damn, man. Pengers, quengers. <laughs> Bless you, sir. They are ugly as sin. Oh, Zimbabwe right. bully cap. Is that actually gonna fit your head? I was scrolling through my phone. He's talking about my big head. I was like, yeah, all right, cool. But your head is looking like a KP peanut right now. Maybe I should get some sunglasses. Oh, very ten cool. pounds. Everything I'm finding is yeah. mad cheap. Yeah, the Depot sunglasses. Yeah. Nah, that on my, under my dungarees, yeah, with a bucket hat would be mad sick. I, I genuinely feel like I captured summer. If someone came out in that, I'd be like, yeah, you look like you're about to go out in the in, in the sunshine, bro. Who knows what's gonna arrive? Who knows what's gonna fit? Who knows who's gonna win? You're gonna have to just find out at the end of the episode. So instead of us coming back to London to do the judging scene, we're busy guys, we're at Fashion Week, we're in Paris right now. So of course we had to take the outro to Paris, get Scott to come through. I ain't got limbs for this. You see me? I'm like a twiglet that was left in the lab and then two weeks later it was gone. It's got its own personality. Oh, we've got to run, guys. We're in a rush. The boys need their outfits. Has anyone got his number? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Whose idea was this? We're in France, aren't we? <laughs> I just clocked, you're saying England. Well, I, I don't know, I think it's like delayed, something like that, but he's got all of our stuff. Maybe he's getting a haircut.
<laughs> God, none of you want to help the guy. Bro, out, I just man. stood up. Come on, common courtesy. Bro, I just stood up. Hey, hey round of applause for Scotty. Buongiorno, guys. How oh, are no. you? How's Paris treating you? Italian. Oh, yeah. So I pretty much just dragged the boys' clothes all the way from London, and it, I've been itching to see what's inside them. Okay, so how'd you guys find it? This isn't actually easy, like... Just to show you guys how hard it is, we got a very good friend of ours to actually make a website where you guys can actually spend £500 in a limited amount of time on Depop, you haven't actually got to buy anything. Make an outfit within the same time that we did. Get clicking on that link, it will be in the description box. If it comes to under £500, you'll get a link, you'll post it on our video, we'll choose a winner, the winners will get £100 Depop gift voucher. I can't wait any longer, get dressed for me. Please. Who's first? Well, usually I get told to get undressed, but... Right. So I feel like Dexter's fit will definitely be... Don't bait it. I mean, he, you don't have to bait anything. Scott's definitely going to already know what you're going to choose. For some reason, I don't know why. It might be the heat. It's going to be all black. Summer. Dex stepped out. Of course, he was wearing all black. I'm sometimes with like things like bucket hats, beanie hats, you know what I'm saying? Accessorizes with a bandana. With the t shirt, I'm, this is an independent brand I found on Depop. I've got the Doom Ring, I've got the polo pouch, I've got a couple chains. Going down to the shorts, these are Dickies, Nike socks. And then I bless myself with the Jordan 4 Oreos. My bandana covers it, but I've got an axe earring and I've got a screw earring. I love it. I think it's kind of different to what I've seen you in before, so like that's refreshing to see. How much did this come to? I spent £257.40. Ooh, so you could get another one. For a summer outfit being all black, I think you've nailed it. So thanks, Dex. Come and sit down next to me, babe. My guy. Killing it. Danny's next, right? Yes, indeed. <laughs> Let's go. That mud is part of a summer accessory. Because I don't I'm, usually walk around on my chest. No, but I've seen people in festivals. <laughs> new, no, 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 no. The crappy shoes that he had on his feet, and emphasis on the word crappy because that's what they look like. I don't know who he bought them off, but you should definitely give that guy a one star. Gucci sunglasses. Oi, oi. So then the bandana, I was going to wear it around my neck. But as soon as I put it on, I was like, you know what? I prefer in the gold chain out. This top, I saw it straight away. It's a Fred Perry Raph Simmons. Acne trousers, which were a bit too long, so I just turned them up inside. White, best, best boys. And then the shoes, bit hit and miss. I can't believe man sent him the crepes with mud still on. So in terms of a summer fit, I think you've aced it. Colour coordination, impeccable. That red, one hue off. So my outfit was £398.39. Okay. All, right. all together. So we've got two out of four outfits done. The pressure is, is, is there, and I'm going to pick a winner. And this could be intense, so uh, make sure to keep watching. Tough one to follow, mate. I hope you got your blagging shoes on. Blagging Siaga. Ha <laughs> ha! Let's do this for real. Snap it, mate. Shaq's feel sick. Might be a bit too hot for the summer, but hey, I wear black. Did get some dungarees. But Papa kept popping, it wouldn't stay up, so I was like, okay, how can I accessorize it? Carl Kanai jeans. Uh, anyone who knows me knows I love Carl Kanai. We wear, bro, and it's very hard to get we wear in the UK. When Shaq came out, I thought, what is that fleece, man? Like, why are you in a fleece in a summer outfit? Bro, the ultimate dad crepe. The crepes. Ooh, they were icy. I don't like sunglasses unless they're kind of like slick, kind of like chic kind of vibe. So I thought, yeah, these would go well with the we wear top as well. And then a bucket hat as well. In summer, I always have a Polaroid camera 
but I thought I might go something a bit different and I see like film is the vibe and it all cost me three hundred pounds on the dot. Do you want my honest opinion? Yeah, if it's cool if you don't like it, bro, just say it. I love it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh I'm not gonna lie though, every time I see you in bucket hats, I just think of your mom. You literally look like your mom. I'm the glasses <laughs> every time. I'm the glasses. Wait, is this Shaq or Gail right now? Cut to a picture of Gail. All right, so we've seen three out of four outfits, right? No then. pressure. This is it. <laughs> Goodbye, auntie. I was about to say, I was about to say, <laughs> Did look like it came straight out of LMFAO, the band. Some Supreme Velour um, Tiger print. Yo, these crepes, yeah, I've been looking for for time and I've seen them about for time as well as the see through Air Forces. Your feet look yellow, bruv. Huh? It's got a tinge to it, mate. Ah, oh, but they're meant to be clear still. Obviously, Ilya, some OG, got to pay homage to her, matches with the fit as well. Then some preem glasses and some a Kango hat. You know, I, w I mean, I wasn't blown away. It was everything he would wear. These trousers are hard. Like, <laughs> in terms of like how much this outfit came to, mm -hmm. what are we talking? 420. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> right, man, if you want to take a load off, I'm going to go outside, have a little think, and choose our champion of the day. I'm really impressed with the boys. Like, I feel like since I judged last, their tastes have elevated. Well, everyone's dressed for, their, for the right occasion for them. Ah, knowing Scott's style, I feel like he might lean more towards Danny. Yeah, I feel the same way as well. I really don't know. You see, I can't even say who I think I was, who's going to win because it's there's tough. yeah, there's elements from everyone like. <sighs> ah, Scotty boy. Gazes, gazes. One of the hardest decisions I've had to make in a long time. Each one of you wins in my mind for a different reason. <sighs> but I have to pick a winner, guys. And. The winner is, on this day, in beautiful, sunny Paris, <laughs> for the Depop Challenge, is... Danny Lomas. Hey. Out of everyone's fits, you took to account the whole summer thing. Everyone did as well, of course, but you took summer in your own ways. <laughs> so, for that reason, I had to make you the winner. Thank you very much, good sir. My pleasure, G. So that has been the Depop episode. Big love to yourself, Scott. It's been a pleasure. This Depop episode has been long overdue, so I hope you guys at home enjoyed it. Also, make sure that you click the link in the description and try the challenge yourself. When you put the link in the comments, we'll choose a winner at the end and they will be gifted. £100 gift voucher from us to spend on Depop. Get it popping in the comments. Get it Depopping. Turn your notifications on as well. Episodes drop every Thursday. Hit the bell. Yo, by the time the episode comes out, we would have hit a quarter of a million subscribers. So shout out to everyone that's kept this movement going so far. Honestly, without you guys, this would not be a possibility. So thank you guys so much. Come on, 2019 million subs. And that's not even a million subs for, for, for us for It's a million subs for all of us, man. We're all a big family, do you know what I mean? Like, if we're winning, you're winning. If you're winning, we're winning. You know what I'm saying? That's what it's all about. We want to show more innovation in fashion. We want to break down more barriers. But we need you guys' help. And the only way we're going to do that is if we work together. So please, guys, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. At least wants to go next because I don't know. No, he wants because to... I won rock paper scissors. That's how why do, these men. Why are you so Why are you so eager to go before? I'm just a man of What's principle. The... If we don't know, the difference is we can't ever do rock paper scissors if you don't it go. It's, it's because I won. No, I'm not gonna add anything. No, just... He's afraid that I might pick something that he might like. No, but it's that's fine. actually not okay. Though. That is the case. That's actually not okay. Then let me go before you. No, because the thing is, what you don't understand is it's the bigger picture. If we do rock, paper, we can't ever do anything like rock, paper, scissors ever again. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. The whole point of rock, paper, scissors is when you can't decide, exactly. you do that as fair so and that... square, equal chance of winning, and then that's it. Let's, that... be, let's be real though, how often do you do rock, paper, scissors? No, but the difference is if we ever, if we ever do orders to go first, we can always do it. That's the thing. No, but we can always flip a coin.
Nah, the flipping the coin. Principle is right, so, whoever right, wins. First of all, first of all, I'm gonna have to ask for spitting in my face. No, because I need to see you spitting because you need to well, need to realize. I'd rather be saying not spraying it. No, I'm gonna spray it because you need to. Well, if, you, well, if you're allowed that. to spray, it, I'm allowed to go next. It's wild. Can we just spray, get, we get this over and done with? Yo, yo, Elias. No, you wanna say? You see, he was gonna insult me and say I'm so stupid or so dumb. See how rude that is. It doesn't make any sense. You nah, can't guilt trip. Man. I left you the moment you started insulting me. I was like, you know what? I'm not going down that road with you. you can Stop go touching next my leg, bro. All right. Seeing the fact you. All right. Weirdo. That's fine. Bro, let's put up a compilation of how many times Ellis touches everybody's body parts in the intro.